check this out. The 2017 to 2018 flu season was the deadliest in years, resulting in a record-breaking number of hospitalizations and at least 80,000 deaths, the Centers for Disease Control said in September. Yet, with all those deaths, did we see any of the hype we now see with the coronavirus? No, not at all. And so far, as of March 18, 2020, we have all of 97 deaths of the coronavirus, but well over 22,000 dead from the regular flu in the 2019-2020 flu season. Why, I ask, are they pushing this coronavirus like it's an extinction event? Well, due to recent issues with YouTube, I am concentrating on my blog for now. See my last two blog entries and the headline updates at nicholaspogm.blog. See the March 16th and March 11th blog entries for many links to pertinent data as well as a bunch of videos. You may also want to keep an eye on my New World Order page on the website, especially now that the Roman Catholic leader of the United Nations just announced his Vatican-approved plans for sustainable development goals under a one-world government by 2030, on camera, no less. And just so you know, they're all lying when using the term epidemic in the news. According to the CDC back in 2003, an epidemic is declared when 7.7% of the population is infected. We are a mere fraction of that number. Oh, and by the way, check out this notice I just received from YouTube Tuesday evening. And so please subscribe to my blog on my main website as I am sure some of my videos are going to be banned soon just as many have been removed in the past by YouTube. With all that said, compile all the fear-filled headlines including how they're linking climate change with the coronavirus now and how Julia Roberts suddenly writes a poem linking the Sabbath with how we should be quarantining people. Being students of prophecy, we know exactly what we're looking at here. Thank you for watching. God bless.